Hello! As promised at the end of my last video, I'm going to show you my latest uh, conversion, uh, a Prussian S102 uh, locomotive. As you can see, the conversion went uh, well, no issues whatsoever. Uh, there was room in the tender uh, under the coal uh, bunker to fit the decoder and the wiring was quite easy. So here you see it uh, going around the layout, pulling my collection of Orient Express uh, coaches. These are the older versions. As you can see, the lights in them um, flicker. They're the old fashioned uh, bulbs in, in them. I have it on a list of things to do to try and get some LED lights with a, some sort of capacitor so that they can run with the lights uh, without the flickering effect and I think that would actually look uh, very nice uh, on, on the layout. As you can see uh, running as I said running smoothly uh, no real issues uh, whatsoever. For an older locomotive it's um, relatively uh, quiet. I mean, it's not. It's it's not perfect by no means. The only uh, the only thing I couldn't do was um, the the front lights. Uh, there's very very little space in the the tender and in the actual body of the locomotive to uh, run the cable through. I may actually have a look at this um, in, in the future. It doesn't bother me uh, that much that, that there's no lights. Also surprisingly there were there was no light uh, in the tender. Uh, I looked at the instructions and unless somebody can correct me it doesn't appear to have ever had uh, a lighting uh, in, in the tender even though the fittings inside seem to be there. There's no electrical connections whatsoever. Now, as you saw, everything runs nice n nice and smoothly. There are, however, some issues with this locomotive, which I only found out when I was doing the conversion. And the main one for me, and again, I'm really surprised at, at this, is there is no power pickup in the tender whatsoever. The power pickup from the tracks is only on the three driving wheels uh, on the locomotive. As you can see here it's actually a tender driven uh, loco. Uh, the, the front wheels they turn very smoothly. There's no issue with that whatsoever. As I said the issue I have is because there's no power pickup in, in the tender there is a very short space for the power to be picked up and there could be issues when going over points uh, etc. As you saw on the the running session uh, I like to keep my track fairly clean so th there was no issues but uh, it's just something to be mindful of. I'm, I'm very surprised that there's no uh, power pickup in, in, in the tender whatsoever. Uh, none of my other locos uh, you know, they all come with the, the, the power pickup, so I'm, I'm surprised at this one. And I've got all the locomotives uh, as well, so again, just something to watch out for. As you can see, uh, this is an older loco, it's a bit uh, dusty, uh, I will need to clean that up a little bit. Anyway, I uh, hope you enjoyed this uh, short video, uh, and as always, uh, if you have any questions, just uh, drop them in the comments box, and until next time, thanks a lot, bye.